G'day and welcome to the Tech Math Channel. In this video, what I'm going to be having a look at is how to mentally add and subtract larger numbers. I'm going to deal with two digit numbers for the minute. Uh, okay, but these are going to be looking at how to add and subtract these in your head. Now, look, some people straight away will think, ah, this is good and easy. I know how to do this already. And look, uh, personally, I've, I've always found this a little bit easier. Uh, but I'll show you the way that I, I tend to work this out because this is not something that comes naturally to everybody. Okay, uh, and if it doesn't, don't worry, I'm going to show you how uh, how we do it. Okay, so this is a really good skill which you can do either, uh, you will be able to do easily. So I'll start with an example here. What about something like, uh, uh, what about I say this 43 plus 17? Do you get 60 straight away? Well, I'll show you the way that I work these out. 43 plus 17. Okay, the way that I think about this is as follows. I, I, I actually, my mind, orders it like this, and, and probably a few people might have a few comments on this, and I'll be interested to see how people's minds differ when they do this. My mind, what it would do, would do this. I would go 43 plus 7, which would equal 50. And then what I would do is I would add, so that's the 7 there I've added, and then I would add the 10. So plus 10 equals 60. Okay? And that's how I mentally add things, okay? Uh, look, sometimes you might decide that you're going to add the 10 first or you're going to add the 7 first. It doesn't really matter. Uh, typically, it's a lot easier to add the smaller numbers on rather than going 17 plus 43, but again, that doesn't really matter either. But you could have quite as easily gone 43 plus 10 is 53 plus 7 is 60. Okay, you see what I mean with that? So it's a really, really easy trick, okay? And some people are going to go, hey, that's not a trick at all. And look, in some ways, for some people, this is something that instinctively comes to them, okay? Uh, but there's a degree of people that won't. So this is the people this video is for, okay? What about something like uh, 37 plus 68? Okay, 37 plus 68, hopefully you get the answer of 105. So, 37 plus 68. So, you'll remember how I did this. What this equaled is I go, first off I'm adding the 60 here. Or, or I can add the 8, but I'm going to add the 60 on this one. So, 37 plus 60 is 97 plus 8. 97 plus 8 is 105. Okay, but I could have just as easily done it the other way, and I could do on 37 plus 8 is 45, and then I 45 plus 60 is 105. Okay, it doesn't really matter which way you do it with that. Okay, so this is the way that when you see people adding and they're, they're really, really uh, proficient at it, this is how we can do it. Okay, it's a matter of first jumping with the units or the tens and then jumping with the other one. Okay. So uh, hopefully you're good with this. What about we try a subtraction here? Alright, uh, what about say 82 take away 14? I'll write that down while you work it out. 82 take away 14. So what answer did you get for that? So 82 take away 4. So 82 take away 4 equals 78. And then 78 take away the 10 equals 68. Okay, so you do have to do those little steps in it, okay? You have to account for everything with those. So 82 take away 14, 68. Yeah. So we're going down by 4 to 78, and then down by 10 to 68. No problem? Okay. What about I give you a, another example here? Uh, what about this one? What about we do uh, 55 take away 39? So take away the 9 first, and you could get the answer of eh? 46 take away the 30. We end up with 16. Okay? So, this one 55 take away the 9. Take away 9 equals 46. And then from the 46, we go down 3 steps, or 
30 steps and we get 16. How do you find that? No problem? Well I'll tell you what, what I'll do is I'll put a couple of examples up here and we'll see how you can go with them, okay? What about, uh, I'll, I'll jot a number of them, some addition and some subtraction ones and we'll see how you go. You might pause them and then see how you go. Alright, so what about uh, 72 take away 24, uh, 33 plus uh, 29, and, uh, uh, well I won't do 100 yet, oh, actually why not, 105 uh, plus 77. See how you go with those. Alright, so first off, 72, we're going to add, we're going to, we're taking away, I've been not start adding. Well, it's a, it's a bit of a trick there, isn't it? Better pay attention to the actual sign. 72 take 4 is 68, take 20 is 48. Okay, how did you go with that? Hopefully good. 33 plus 9 is 42 plus 20 is 62. 105 plus 7 is 112 plus 70 is 182. They're not too bad are they? Hopefully you do pretty good with those. Practice those a lot. Some people again are going to be fine at those already and they've probably tuned out already but if you're just starting with those Good luck on those, it's a really, really great skill. And the more you do that, this is one of these basic math things, which is probably the most important thing you get, and that's why I'm making this video. Okay, so keep practicing it, and hopefully you get really good at it. I'll see you next time.